Uh, hmm. Tower of London? Getting inside will be a challenge, I imagine. I'd like to help, fam, but now I just caught a whiff now. With all the CTOS cameras, it'd take him less than five to ID me. I ain't risking my pretty face. We need an Albion insider for our caper, one who's willing to turn coat. I've reached out to a contact who works in a nearby pub. Where better to find a bleakly disillusioned anti-hero numbing their conscience with drink, but secretly desperate for redemption? I've let our contact know what we're in the market for, and she's nearby. Hello. You lot certainly know how to pick your targets. You do know that Albion have set up their headquarters in there, right? Trust me, we wouldn't be doing this if there was an alternative. But we have to find out what new Project Cass is unveiling at this meeting. There's no other choice. Fucking Nigel Cass. You're right. Nothing good can come of this. Luckily, I hear loads of sob stories working in a pub. And near this place, quite a few from Albion are dissatisfied with the status quo. You turn on the charm, and I'm sure you can get one to join the good guys. Even got a candidate in mind. Interesting. Send me the personal information. I'll have Bagley push it along. Good luck, love. Leave me alone, you giant flying hand! We're aware of an Albion employee who might be approachable. Well, I'm sure recruiting someone from Albion will prove to be a unique challenge. They're jackbooted thugs who regularly murder civilians. If finding a disenchanted employee is really that difficult, humanity is much worse off than I thought. It would also be quite useful to have someone on the inside. For however long that lasts, Nigel's real good at sniffing out spies. Personal experience speaking? Yeah, not really in a sharing mood right now. Fam. I get the impression you're not satisfied with London's current state. Fuck me. Dead sec. All right, maybe you could help. Got myself in a bit of trouble. We'll see. What's the problem? My friend's got this rare blood disorder, and with the NHS in the state it's in, he hasn't been able to get proper treatment in months. The Clan Kelly doctor offered an experimental treatment. A pricey experimental treatment. We didn't have a lot of choices, so I paid. Go on. The meds were working. My mate was getting better, but then, well... He got hooked. That's when the doc suddenly decides to rack up the prices. That piece of shit knew what he was doing. I see. Don't worry. We'll get the right medicine for your friend. What are you up to? Well, this quote-unquote doctor is a real winner. 
He was struck off the medical register for gross malpractice last year, and now he's a freelance mob surgeon. Nice work if you can get it. Can you track him down, Bagley? I am quite literally always tracking everyone down. Pushing you with coordinates now. Frank Kelly, doctor you're looking for, is close by. Seems he's got a laptop with him too, presumably with a folder somewhere on it labelled Crimes.
There's the laptop. Laptop scraped. Get to safety while I analyze the data. I found them a warehouse where experimental drugs are being stored. I'm sure Mary Kelly won't mind if you nick a few. I'm detecting a vehicle nearby with at least two years' worth of treatments inside. That's more than enough to wean our contact's friend off the treatment. All right. There's the vehicle with the drugs in it. Try not to destroy it. Where to? I found a safe location where a friend can pick it up. Sending you the coordinates now. Help! Now! Albion employee who might be approachable.
If you want to make a difference, you should work with us. So, you are with DATSEC, yes? I may be able to pass along a message. Okay, I have a problem with Plan Kelly. Maybe you will help me. Go on. Okay, listen to me. Some low-level dummies have been putting pressure on old people and shopkeepers for their money. Typical gangster shit. I can take all their crypto by one transaction, but I need their private key. And you need dead sec to help you find it? Exactly. With that file, I'll be able to get back everything they stole. Do this and I will owe you a favor. Trust me, this is a good thing for you. All right. No time to waste then. Could you not stand so close? Network traffic points to the private key bin on some kind of mobile server, probably a van in one of their hideouts. That's a bit close. What? Hey, you're in my space. You are hey, you're in my space. In case you forgot, the private key you're after is on a server in a van. All right. Clear the area. Obviously. That's the vehicle there. of what our prospect would have wanted. Oh well. We're aware of an Albion employee who might be approachable.
Are you interested in joining the resistance? Oh, uh, you're done dead, Sekir. How do I know you're not in bed with the new Earthers? What? It's a secret cult. Forcing be kidnapping people to live in an underground bunkers, them called New Earth. Everywhere you go, they're underfoot, and they kill anyone who gets in their way. Uh... Here, I found some of them. It wasn't easy, believe me. I almost got caught. But here's the list. You handle them, and maybe that can build some trust. I'll get it done. Jesus, Mary and Joseph Bagley, did that even have a shred of credibility to it? Oh no, he's off his fucking lid for sure. Allegedly, his shadowy cabal is headquartered at a nearby Albion field office. Might be worth investigating regardless. Might be. Well, at the very least, we might learn something about Albion. What do we have, Bagley? Some Albion guards posted here are selling pallets of high-tech weaponry to Clan Kelly at a healthy markup. I mean, sure, it's corrupt, but it hardly rises to the level of evil scheme. Nothing a little destruction can't fix.
That's one way to take out the competition. I'll tell our prospect that good news. Speaking of which, I have some exciting news about the man you just helped. There are the weapons. Conspiracy so thoroughly it never existed in the first place. Should we inform our friend? Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank oh. Cheers. You're a lifesaver. We're being contacted by our potential recruit. Patching them through now. I will you want. The best recompense you could give us would be to join the cause. Just what I was hoping to hear. I'm in. care of everyone on your list. Now, I don't want to argue with you, but there was no conspiracy. Just a bunch of evil bastards trying to line their pockets. No, no, the bunkers are real. I have the schematics and everything. They must have... Ah, I see. They got rid of the evidence as soon as they saw you. It's a setback, to be sure, but it does mean I can trust you. DedSec is looking to fill the ranks. You should join. Just what I was hoping to hear. I mean... We have an Albion operative on our roster. We should let them know they're needed.
A resistance is only as good as the people in it. We're happy to have you. Thanks. I'm ready to bring real justice where it's needed. Fuck yeah. Okay. Oh, Nigel Cass's meeting will begin soon. Approach the Tower of London when you're ready. Now, extending Albion's contract, to me, that's like having a pet dog, let's call it Nigel. Totally an accident. That attacks you every single day and thinking to yourself, wouldn't it be nice if Nigel had puppies? <laughs> that contract has been extended so many times, it's like the neck of a politician that's criticised the government. <laughs> I'm not sure entirely how those contract extension negotiations were, probably not. Like a, like a footballer. In the old days, I assume Albion's agent was leaking stories to the press about how our favourite private militia was being tapped up by Barcelona. <laughs> you know, the government panics and thinks we'll better get them signed up before it's too late. But still, violent crime, record low, although I imagine it probably depends exactly how you count it. If you include violent crime committed by the state, either themselves or via Albion, their chosen violent crime contractors, who provide such a very valuable bargain service of beating people up, well, it's probably not quite as low as the figures. If we're lucky, word hasn't spread that you've hung up your jackboots. Just try to put on your meek, harmless, broken by the system face. Oh, and don't forget your uniform. Looking sharp, your ex-colleagues won't pay any attention to you unless you let them take a close look. Investigation under... Surrender yourself. Failure to comply will result in extreme measures. Halt! Failure to comply will result in...
Moving in. Last place I saw them. Check it out. Seems that manky little nerd was the one who kept diverting relief supplies away from the borough to keep everyone in line for Albion. These days you can do a lot more evil with a spreadsheet than a drone fleet. Wonderful. A word of caution now we're inside. Any disturbance in here and Nigel Cass will surely cancel his meeting. Avoid being detected by your former colleagues or this operation is a bust. Nigel won't have anything important on this floor. How is it you know more about him than I do? Yeah, I was Albion too, if you hadn't tweaked to that. Me and Cass were close once. Looked up to him. <laughs> he was bigger than life, fam. Literally a tech genius, and I was just a gearhead kid. I wanted to be like him. That's why I joined up. Seriously, for real? Didn't find out he was a murderous prick until later. You don't think it's going to make certain uh, aspects Everything of our is job redundant, do you? And Mr. Not a chance. The record of cast takes care of his own. You know that. I believe he has to be put before coming in. I've got enough to do. I heard someone saying dead sick. They better not be just a bunch of terrorists pretending to have more. This door clearly requires a security pass. Wonderful. Use one of the nearby computers to create your forgery. Be careful. You don't want to know what Nigel does with trespassers. You been up there, Lee? There are some parts of this city that need a good working water with some heavy boots. You understand? Yeah, I know what you mean. But there's always an element that's gonna resist all, right? Sure, but I thought we'd taken care of that. I've heard some talk on the street that they made on the back in It'll take some time for the forgery to be ready. To keep you occupied, I dragged up still images and a recording from an internal investigation into Cassini's death. Show me. Jesus Christ, me have issues, but this, this is our next level, you know. Them choose him, are all people to secure London? Blood clot. Yeah, well, Nigel's never close to anyone but his dad. And me, I guess. Never had much faith in people, really. Well, the pass is ready, but rough. If this resistance thing doesn't work out, I doubt you'll make a living as a document forger. Let's give it a go anyway. Nigel Cass awaits. How's it going? Mr. Cass. Oh, you no good good to the I know, I know, but if I mess this up, the vision whole project is delayed. No, how? Don't even joke about that. I don't even want to think about what directing Casper did. Just, just make sure. Welcome to Project Themis.
our new autonomous drones. These drones can identify, isolate, and terminate threats before they can do harm. They can go anywhere, see everything. They could kill a man alone in an alley or in a crowd of hundreds with perfect precision. Themis drones can do what humans have always struggled to. Act immediately and decisively. Without your support, I couldn't stand here and tell you. But I promise you, that with the launch of Project Emmys, London will be the first city in the world to be made truly safe. Mr. Cass, I was hoping you called us all in here today to discuss the ethical issues. <laughs> no, it's all right, the Commissioner cares, as we all do. I admire his, his passion and his dedication. Let's talk ethics. Well. For one, Themis goes far beyond Albion's mandate. We really should have more government consultation. I see. Delay the launch so that we can debate and assess the details. We're missing the human element here. I can get the defense minister on the line right now. Well, if you feel you must. human element that got us into this. No more debate, delay, indecision. Understand this. I will not allow anyone, not even myself, to jeopardize Themis. Now, will our friends at Tidus be ready? You are the cornerstone of the project, after all. Do you need to consult any outside parties? Uh... No. We'll be ready. And just in time. Criminals running our streets. Illegals threatening our families. The police commissioner himself. Assassinated by terrorists. Decisiveness is hard. But here's the best part. Once this decision is made, no more will be required of you. Attention, a building-wide security sweep has been initiated due to Dr. Orange. I warned you about that forgery. Your uniform will help. Don't let them get a close look at you. I need an exit. The catacombs, fam. Go, go, go! go, go, go. You an action in there, didn't you? Man can be very uh, persuasive. But in control, that was for effect. But also to get results. To get Themis launched as soon as possible.
funding for the resistance. Oh, hell. Mm -mm, I don't like this. Albion's top secret project is an automated killing machine. And it looks like Cass is almost ready to launch. We have to get Themis out of his hands. I'll prepare a briefing. Will we see you there, Hamish? Pretty face, not risking, remember? But patch me in. You and me got some scheming to do, Bagley. Yeah. 